the aviation and hospitality sector is betting big on 2020. Here is a look at what they're planning. We wanted to encourage travel by families within India, primarily to heritage destinations and to important tourist destinations. It's basically to give a push to tourism. The company uh, is going through a huge investment, which is over $400 million, to renovate completely our uh, uh, cabins, I would say. It's not only you know, business class uh, cabin, but it's also uh, economy. We are focusing on uh, corporate traffic as well as leisure Indian outbound traffic through other two operators and leisure traffic producers. This is a special uh, year for us because we're going to go also double daily daily. Actually in 2020 we're 20 years in India so it's going well, it's going well for this market and we're so proud to be here. From next spring during the, the India market high season, so April to June, we will actually fly daily between Mumbai and Seychelles. In the long term plan we do have Ahmedabad and uh, Calicut that we will start uh, because our expansion into Gujarat market was not there. It is a huge potential in that market, so Ahmedabad is there. No shoulds, no musts, no can'ts, no wants. This is Nevada, the weirdest, wildest west. actual hotel numbers that we have in India. Touching on 52 right now, but we see a lot of growth moving into the future in 2020 is three to four hotels, depending on the timing. We wanted to introduce our new brand slot, uh, like uh, Best Western Premier, uh, uh, Glow, Aden, and Executive Residency by 2021 in India. We are looking at uh, signing more properties and opening more hotels uh, in the uh, Tier 2 and Tier 3 cities, uh, which are very, very important. We are now going to open uh, uh, a welcome hotel in Bhuvaneshwar, welcome hotel in Guntur. We are opening up a welcome hotel in Chael. Uh, we are going to be opening up uh, a welcome hotel in Chennai. Uh, we are opening up a welcome hotel in Mashobra. Uh, then we also in 20 will open up a hotel, luxury hotel, ITC Narmada in Ahmedabad. We are now venturing into the northeast, just about to conclude two properties in the northeast region. And I think that will be a stepping stone to more places to come. In our upcoming properties, we are looking for the state of Goa, that is in pipeline and maybe in Diu, in Union Territory. So that is in our uh, pipeline uh, roadmap for the future.